How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some mysterious things caught on camera. But as always, before we dive in, remember to hit that subscribe button and get ready for more creepy content. Just like this. In the quaint town of Port Huron, located on the US-Canada border, residents have been left baffled by a series of unusual images capturing a strange colourful light shooting up into the night sky. Facebook user Patricia Forrester McCauley shared these perplexing images with us, asking if anyone knew the source of the phenomenon. Port Huron is situated across the lake from Chemical Valley, an area known for its abundance of factories. While the townspeople are no strangers to seeing the sky illuminated during factory burn-offs, this recent event has left them puzzled. According to Macaulay, the images she posted were unlike anything she's ever seen before. The images depict an eerie bolt of light varying in colour from red to orange, piercing the night sky. Intriguingly, some have drawn parallels between the red light and the upside down from the popular TV show Stranger Things. As the images circulated, more than 100 comments poured in from viewers attempting to unravel the mystery behind the unusual sighting. Speculation run rampant, with theories ranging from secret government experiments to extraterrestrial activity. Others, however, have suggested more mundane explanations, such as an unusual reflection of light or even a camera glitch. So what do you think's been captured on camera here? I'd love to hear your theories on this strange sighting in the comments down below. On August 19, 1987, during the 4pm edition of KMBC's Channel 4 News in Los Angeles, a shocking scene unfolded, as Gary Stolman, a man on a mission to expose a global alien conspiracy, infiltrated the NBC Burbank studios and took news anchor David Horowitz hostage live on air. Let me see what it says. All right. Armed with what appeared to be a gun, Stallman pressed it to Horowitz's side and demanded he read a statement while live on air. To read this, uh, this, this copy which was just handed to me, you want to tell me your name or not? What is it? And Gary, where are you from? While viewers were captivated by the unfolding drama, KNBC News Director Tom Capra made the decision to take the news feed off the air within 28 seconds of Stallman's appearance. At that point, the control room was ordered to go to black, kill the studio mics and put up a standby slide. The station then displayed the NBC logo with a voiceover message explaining technical difficulties before broadcasting promotions for its evening programming. It was later revealed that the gun was nothing more than an empty toy prop. I was warned in 1981 by someone with connections at the CIA to stay off the computers, that they didn't trust people on computers. Stolman, a 34-year-old from Tallahassee, Florida, was the son of former KNBC pharmaceutical reporter Max Stolman. He had bypassed the station's security by exploiting his father's former position and enlisting the help of a TV newswoman who granted him access to the studio. During the tense situation, Horowitz remained calm despite his inner turmoil. When I began receiving disturbing calls from my parents, which led me to believe that something terrible was going on. Stallman's statement contained an alarming mix of claims surrounding alien conspiracies, UFOs, and the replacement of his family members with clones. The incident was a culmination of a long and harrowing journey for Stallman, who believed he was fighting against an alien plan for global domination. The bizarre incident prompted discussions on security measures in television studios. Stallman's actions, born out of desperation to share his beliefs, ultimately led to a frightening and unforgettable moment in live television history that rocked the world. I was warned in 1981 by someone with connections at the CIA to stay off the computers, that they didn't trust people on computers. On October 1st, 2022, a terrified Tennessee mother, Ashley Scott, came to believe her home was haunted after receiving a chilling video of her baby appearing to be pushed by an unseen force. Scott was grocery shopping when her partner Chris Geisler sent her the unsettling footage captured on their home security camera. The couple now fears for their one-year-old son Gavin's safety. The video shows Gavin crawling into his parents' bedroom where his father is watching TV. Watch what happens. Um. 
The baby stops on all fours, glancing at his dad for a moment before suddenly jolting forward as if shoved from behind. Gavin nearly face plants and then turns around as if to look for the source of the push, but there's nothing there. Scott's convinced that a ghost was responsible for the forceful push and she's now fearful of what other forces may do next. Both Scott and Geisler have experienced other unexplained occurrences in their condo since moving in three years ago, such as inexplicable noises and crashes. However, this is the first time they've encountered something they perceive as violent, which has heightened their concerns for Gavin's safety. Scott, a stay-at-home mum, has always believed in the paranormal, recalling encounters with mysterious figures during her childhood. The couple is now on edge and considering moving if any other further incidents occur, as they worry about what other forces may be capable of harming their son. A recent social media post has drawn attention to a series of alleged ghostly encounters on a road in the Tolima region of Colombia. The accounts describe a young girl's spirit haunting the area, with travellers on the route reporting unsettling experiences, particularly when riding on motorcycles. Due to these strange occurrences, locals have even been requesting accompaniment from authorities when traversing the area. According to one witness, a photograph captured the alleged ghost girl hanging onto the back of a truck travelling along the road at night time. The person, who previously didn't believe in supernatural beings, was driving with friends and family when they noticed the girl. Initially, they believed her to be a real child and took photos to document what they perceived as the truck driver's irresponsibility. When the group caught up to the truck and informed the driver about the girl, he calmly stated that he didn't have a girl travelling with him. He also said he was already aware of the strange ghostly girl stories. Residents in the Quello rural area of Tolima have corroborated these claims, noting that motorcyclists often feel the presence of the girl sitting just behind them. The community expresses concern for the restless spirit, saddened that the young girl has not found peace. This is just one of the many mysterious stories that have emerged from the region, including legends of gold-filled pools guarded by the devil himself. As word of the alleged haunting spreads, locals and travellers remain both apprehensive and captivated by the ghost girl's presence on this strange Colombian road. This next strange sighting comes out of Ecuador. It's some puzzling CCTV footage that's been shared to TikTok by Fabrizio Mendez215.0. Take a look. At first, you might think this is nothing more than a security camera glitch. However, the incident becomes more puzzling when a second security camera captures the exact same sighting. Watch. In both pieces of footage captured by separate cameras simultaneously, the man walking along the street seems to vanish into thin air. Naturally, the bizarre capture has spurred a range of spectacular theories. Everything from time traveller to ghost to someone slipping into an alternate dimension has been suggested. Unfortunately, there's very little other information to run with regarding this bizarre sighting. So for now, I'll throw this one out to you, the viewers. What do you think's been captured here? Let your theories rip in the comments down below. A TikToker by the username irish.blood101 has sent shivers down the spines of social media users, with an unsettling video captured during a repair job at a disused emergency care home facility in Conroe, about 40 miles north of Houston. The reason behind the facility's closure remains unknown, but the TikToker was assigned to fix some leaking pipes on the property. Uh, I'm not sure why it closed down, but it's pretty spooky. 
I'm supposed to be looking for a leak in here. In the footage, the property appears to be abandoned. Creepy hallway. Real spooky place. However, as the TikToker explores the area, a faint whisper can be heard. Another bathroom. If we listen to that again, it sounds like someone says, I see you. Another bathroom. The spine chilling encounter doesn't end there. As the TikToker looks up a flight of stairs, something truly eerie happens. It sounds like someone running towards the camera holder. Collecting his nerve and realising that there's no one actually there, he continues searching for the leaking pipes. There's a lot of natural lighting in here. I, don't, I probably don't need the flashlight right now. Towards the end of the clip, more unexplained banging sounds echo through the facility, ultimately sending this TikToker running in fear. Creepy. Okay, now I'm getting the fuck out of here. That was it. With these mysterious occurrences documented in the video, viewers are left wondering if the abandoned care home could be haunted by the spirits of its former residents. Before we take a look at an eerie photo captured by a home security system, remember to hit that subscribe button, then tickle that little bell icon there and turn on all channel notifications. That way you'll be in the loop every time we drop our scary and eerie videos. A Pennsylvania mother of four was left so shaken by a ghostly figure captured on her security camera that she couldn't sleep, and her family's now contemplating moving to a different home. Amanda Peard, age 34, recounted her chilling experience to the mirror, describing how she woke up to heavy footsteps in her house at 3.40am on October 21. When she checked the security camera, she saw what appeared to be a ghostly figure standing in her kitchen doorway. Pitt immediately woke her husband, Jeffrey, and sent him downstairs to confront the possible intruder. However, they found no one in the house and no evidence of a break-in. The family's dog, Ollie, was found pacing around the kitchen. Unable to sleep, Pitt watched some TV and repeatedly checked the camera, hoping that she had imagined the figure. The family, who moved into the home in 2020, has experienced other unexplained occurrences, including receiving security notifications when there's no one home and hearing strange noises. The first truly bizarre event was captured on camera when a door in the house opened by itself, and on another occasion the kitchen sink turned on without human interaction. Pitt, who previously didn't believe in ghosts, admits that the recent events have made her question everything. As the family grapples with their unsettling experiences, they're considering moving to a different home to escape the seemingly haunted property. So what do you think's been caught on camera here? Is it an intruder? or a ghost as the family suspects. Love to hear your thoughts on this one in the comments down below. If you love mysterious videos like this one, then check out our other content. There's an episode there. Otherwise, there's a massive paranormal playlist right there that'll keep you entertained. Now remember to follow us on all our other socials as well. There's links in the description box below. And that's it for me. I'll see you all next time.